The Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation, NNPC, is the central nerve of Nigeria's economy. It's the only body that explores, produces, refines, transports and markets oil and gas in Nigeria. The corporation has been accounting for over 70% of government's revenue, but has not been free of scandals. Back in 2013, an audit report by PricewaterhouseCoopers implicated NNPC in the diversion of $12 billion it was meant to remit to the government as revenue, besides other accusations of corrupt dealings. Petroleum Minister Emmanuel Ibekaichuku says the corporation is inefficiently managed and proposed an overhaul. The idea that was initially protested by petroleum industry workers, but they too have also decided to support a restructured NNPC. And industry observers think the move is long overdue. The NNPC as is, is extremely opaque. Um, if not for the coming of the new minister, we will not know if NNPC was a loss uh, was making losses. I remember a former minister of finance has said NNPC was broke and the guy was fired. This was 2008 or 9 and he was fired. So over time people have asked what are your operations? It's so opaque, we don't know what you're doing, we do not, we, your books have never been audited. So NNPC now has five core new divisions comprising the upstream, downstream, refining group, gas and power as well as ventures groups. By restructuring, the ministry says it's only attempting to rid the cooperation of redundant workforce. Industry watchers believe decentralizing the NNPC would make operations more effective and profitable. NNPC has been a loss leader in its, uh, in, its, um, in its operations and in the industry as a whole. And I think it's time that we turned it, or hopefully the minister should be able to turn it into, uh, into the, put it on the path of profitability. The corporation also came under sharp scrutiny over persistent fuel crises, threatening to bring the economy on its knees. But the ministry says it's aiming at total elimination of imported fuel. For that, the ministry has given itself a deadline of 18 months. President Buhari came into office promising to fight endemic corruption in the petroleum industry. It's not clear if the overhaul in the NNPC will end corruption into Nigeria's most important sector. What's clear, though, is the government will be keen to ensure every penny is spent in the right place, especially with the shrinking oil revenue. Kelechi Amekalam, CCTV Abuja, Nigeria.